present but I don't have anything and I don't know what to get her. <sighs> this is so hard. Ah, I know. I could try to make her a necklace. Yeah, that'd be perfect. Woo! So all right, twins, everything's banned. So it looks like Circo is going to make Frieza a necklace. So I have some of this uh uh Hemp, hemp stuffy, hemp stuff, whatever. Okay, so uh, since Breeze's favorite color is pink, I'm going to cut some pink. It's three strands of pink, so. I don't know if the others are into it. Okay. Ah! Eh. <laughs> 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 three little strands. They're not all the same length, but it's perfectly fine. So now I'm just going to take a Cerico here because I'm guessing the two wind dancers probably have the same shape of their necks. So I'm just going to kind of, it's going to be kind of hard to get it when I, when I braid it to tie it and getting it so it can come up its head. Well, let's start braiding it. So all I'm going to do to braid it is um, find the start to this tape. Don't you dare fall back on there now. So I've got a nice decent piece of tape. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick this to the edge of my desk. And you can hear my squeaky creep, creaky chair. So um, I'm just going to take all three of my ends like so. Stretch them out and just tie them in a, in a knot together. So, I can't do it right. Okay. Well, that's my best knot. So, that's going to have to be how it is for now. So, now I'm just going to take my tape. Oh, what is that? Yeah, whatever. So, now I'm just going to take my tape. And tape it down, just start braiding. So this part might be a little challenging since his mane is there, but it's going to be perfectly fine. So we need to get it so it's kind of like this right here, but it needs to be able to come off the top of his head. Yeah, okay, so I think this is perfect. Except for one thing, how am I going to tie it? And it's still being perfect. Aha, I got it. Just going to take it off, keep it on this mark, and just double knot it right then and there. So now you have a, a necklace. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a little extra charmy to put on there. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So I found this little diamond bead in one of the bead containers that we have. So now I'm just going to take this white thread and cut it so that's nice and long. So now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take this, ooh, make that so it's, uh, I have to be careful with the scissors, ooh, I almost like, chopped myself up. Well, not really, these are kind of safety scissors, but I have big, sharp scissors at school, so. Don't think I use these uh, little baby scissors that didn't fit me. Okay, well, oh, come on. That's not safe. <laughs> come on. 
my scissors. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to tie it in a nice knot like that. So then the diamond will stay on. Now it's time to take the necklace and find the center here. So I think this is about the center. Pull it up. Take the two strands of your thread and tie the jewel on there. Then you can put knot it. Ah, just killed Silco. <laughs> I'm a wind dancer murderer. No, just kidding. Okay. And tie it on there one last time. Cut off those and voila, you have a nice necklace and it's really pretty too. Brisa! Huh? Brisa, Brisa! Circo? Got you a necklace. Oh, it's so beautiful. Circo, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. How about you uh, go ahead and try it on? Okay. Oh, it's so beautiful. Circo, thank you. You're welcome, Brisa. I'm gonna go see how it shimmers in the light. I love it. It does look very beautiful on you. I love it. You know what? I love even more than it. You. <gasps> Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.